I had gone to the doctor and was diagnosed with bronchitis. The doctor gave me medicine and said, if you're not better in 10 days, come back. I went back in 10 days because I wasn't feeling any better and they decided to do a chest x-ray and it was that chest x-ray that showed something that concerned them. So that doctor sent me to have a CAT scan done to get a better look at it and the CAT scan showed a definite tumor as well as blood clots in my lung. When I got the diagnosis, I was not shocked. I was not surprised uh, because I had been a smoker for 40 years. So Anne, unfortunately, represents what we commonly find in lung cancer. With lung cancer, we often don't have any sign or hint that it's there until it may be fairly, uh, fairly advanced. So our cure rates, unfortunately, for lung cancer are not nearly as good as we would wish them to be. We're not doing as well with lung cancer as we are with some other types of cancer out there, especially the ones that we can detect early with screening tests. In Anne's case, she presented at stage three, and we often are not able to do surgery for stage three. Some patients are, but in her case, it was not at what was considered an operable stage. So we offered her a combination of chemotherapy and radiation, which still can be curative for many patients with stage three lung cancer. The first appointment I had with Dr. Donor after I'd been diagnosed with lung cancer, I was very upfront asking questions. He looked at me and he said, I know that you'll be one of my success stories because of your attitude and, and you are just ready to go. And you have no idea how much that is going to help you through this process. She received a combination of radiation and chemotherapy over several months and so far is doing well and appears again to be in a complete remission, meaning with no detectable cancer at this point. It's now two and a half years later. I returned to work in August after I finished my treatments. He gave me a second chance. Dr. Jenner and Texas Oncology have become my support group from day one. I can't imagine having done it without them.